Hello, this is Roger Bisbee here from the Skill Builder channel, back with another Ask Skill Builder, and this time it's from Twin Davis, and he's bought himself a 1930s Art Deco house, and uh, he's got a little bit of a problem. Let's have a look at it. This is what he's got, brickwork above a window, but it looks like there's no lintel there whatsoever. It's been built without any support for this piece of brickwork. So let's try and show you what's going on in a wider picture. So here you can see a better picture of it. And what he's got here is a corner thing. This is fairly typical of these 1930s. A lot of the time these were done with crittled windows, but somebody's put in something there, PVC or aluminium. They've taken away whatever support there may have been for that window. If there's a post in there inside that box section, then that's fine because that would support that corner. But really, it needs a bit of a lintel going across into the brickwork there, at least 150 millimetres into that brickwork. And then the lintel would come out there. And then I don't know what's happening around the other side, but it looks to be better. So maybe that's where the concrete lintel is. And maybe they just filled this bit in with a bit of brickwork, thinking that wouldn't matter. If you're going to cantilever these things, you need some weight on top of them. It won't work if you just put a cantilever across here, like a lintel that you've you've put on the top and then gone through. But of course, you could do something if you had a lintel, some kind of even a steel support going through there, galvanized steel support behind this bit of brickwork. And then that was bolted down into this brickwork here. But it needs some work. And the first thing I'd want to do is probably just take away that bit of brickwork, see if you can see whether that post is in there, whether it's offering any support or whether there's no support at all, because it doesn't look great up there, does it? So once that's done, once you get that bit of support in there, probably going to need a bit of scaffolding. It doesn't want to take the, the roof off, and I can understand that. It looks like it might be a rubber roof, which means it's not too bad to take off. You can take those trims off, just peel it back probably. If you can get away without doing that, then well and good, and just put a bit of concrete lintel in there, some kind of support in here. If it hasn't got one, then you need a steel post going in there which you can get made up from a blacksmith or any sort of steel fabricators to be able to make you up a corner post for there. And then, of course, it's got to be clad with a bit of frame. But it may be there. Who knows? It may be there and it may be the only problem he's got is this little bit of brickwork here, which obviously you can see is crumbling badly. Definitely needs sorting out. But it doesn't look like a great job, does it, really? The render's obviously in very poor state. That, that's going to need replacing. And then you can see what's gone on down here. This is actually concrete. This is the structural concrete here. Now, this looks all right. This would be the cantilever bit. That seems to suggest that everything off that bit of concrete cantilever, supposing that's the floor. So that floor is all cast in, cantilevered out there. If you've got a post on there, you can pick up the top. Everything would be hunky-dory. So I hope that helps. It's not horrendous. It's going to need a good bricky, good plasterer to do the rendering, just some kind of support there to hold that bit of brickwork up. But you could do it even with an L-shaped galvanized lintel. It would work, you know, that kind of uh, thing that you get for face brickwork that just picked up that bit of brickwork behind, but you couldn't actually see it. Something, you know, a variation on the boot lintel, if you like. Have a look at the Keystone lintels. I'm pretty sure they've got something that will help, but if they haven't, they can make specials up. If you send them a drawing, if you know what you want, and you may need a structural engineer to tell you what you want, they will be able to make up a lintel that would go across that whole corner but it looks like you might not need that because you've got one side which seems fine and it's only one side that's a problem. These Art Deco 1930s buildings, it's all very well, weren't they? A bit of shelf building, you know, having a corner that isn't supported. Oh, fantastic. They thought they were the bee's knees, those guys. I mean, a lot of the time, it just leads to trouble. I'm Roger Bisbee. Thanks very much for watching. Come back and see us soon and we'll have more Ask Skill Builders. If you want to send one in to us, by the way, here's the form. It's very, very simple. Just... Type in this, you can drop your videos and your photographs, put your question with it and we'll do the rest.